The farther we get from Athens, the quieter it grows. As though it's peaceful. But I know better. I'm sorry, Aspasia. About Pericles. And Athens. You have no need to apologize. For anything. I did everything I could to keep people safe. No one thinks otherwise, Cassandra. The cult of Cosmos simply had a plan we didn't see soon enough. And they struck when the time was right. About Phoebe. No, allow me. Phoebe was my responsibility. I should have kept her closer to me. It was a mistake. No, I wanted to apologize. It wasn't your fault. I'm sorry. Yet another murder to the cult's credit. I'll make each of them beg for mercy before I kill them. The time will come. For now, let us look to the future. Do you have a heading? I was hoping you would help me with that. Yes, of course. This woman, Phinecas. Her ship was called Siren Song. Phinecas. Yes, I know the name. Last anyone heard, her ship was docked on the island of Naxos. <sighs> then we go to Naxos to see Phinecas. All right, hit him with that intro, John. All right. Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with CNC. I ain't on my DX Explosive on Jonas. I'm the man on us. You are. We just finished Chapter 6, bro. We're playing Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Yeah, dude. Couchman is not here, guys. For all you that loved his... <laughs> anecdotal his anecdotals through us i guess yeah dude it is the most awkward thing to try to repeat when you're having a conversation with, with somebody that's all right i think they came across well it, i blame jonas for not having a heart where he's a sound guy dude <laughs> jonas is the sound guy didn't have an, another mic or a way to hook it up yeah dude you gotta roll with the punches you gotta roll with the punches yeah it's all right jonas cleon every man all right where the frick am i going dude a mother's prayers, man. Oh, you're going to answer mama's prayers, dude. You're mater. My mater would not enjoy if oh, I... Oh, now you have all your all your quests back. Yeah, I figure as much. A mother's progress. All right, so we can do this. Or I could do... Oh, wait, no. This is this. Meet Marinini and Naxios. Let's go to Naxios, ma'am. Yeah, I'm down oh, to go to any of us. Look at there. It's so far away. Let me make sure I don't have to avoid any large land masses. Because that's that's a problem sometimes. <laughs> oh my gosh. You guys at the crazy town know what I'm talking about. I have to avoid nothing, dude. I just got to cross a bunch of ocean. So, Jonas. You gotta, Banter time! <laughs> it's band time, fam. Dude, <laughs> what you who's talk? your favorite new kid? Uh, Donnie McClurkin. Donnie McClurkin? Donnie Brian McKnight. Dude, Brian McKnight, he did things. He dated, uh, what's her name, right? Uh, Halle Berry? No, um, what's the girl, dude? She had the songs Candy. Halle Minogue? Candy. I'm missing you like candy. She was hot. Mandy Moore. Mandy Moore, huh? Yeah, didn't they date? Um... I don't know, dude. I don't know who I don't know who Brian McKnight's boo is anymore. You don't know who Mandy Moore is? I know who Mandy Moore is, dude. She was in that movie and she was dying. Yeah, I don't know what that they is. They took a walk. They remembered it. No, that's Stage the Last Dance. No, it's Julia Stiles. <laughs> Whatever happened to Julia Stiles? Dude, I think she wouldn't like bang the Hollywood producers and they outcast her. Really? She was always. I mean, she disappeared. To I mean, it makes sense she wouldn't, like, do the things that other actresses did that the Weinsteins got involved in. She was always trying to, like, get with a black dude in every movie she was in. That's true, except for 10 Things I Hate About You, where she's trying to get with Heath Ledger, who ended up dying of an overdose. Did that happen? Heath Ledger? No, the, uh, the movie. Yeah, that was the first movie she was in. I've never heard of that movie. Um, was there any black guys in the movie? No, no. She was trying to, uh, she was trying to get with him. And, yeah, but every other movie, you're right. She was always trying to get with a black dude. Like, Save the Last Dance and Othello. Othello. 
See, this guy wants smoke, you know what I'm Smoke it up. I'm going to look up what happened to Julia Stiles. <laughs> what happened to Julia Stiles? Um, the same. You think I'm scared of you? You think I'm scared of you, sir? Come here. Level 27. My buddy. Can I ram happen. this man? I'm gonna ram this man. More speed. Yeah, you see me? You see me rolling. I'm waving. Oh, dude, that guy has. Are you gonna try taking him out? Yeah, dude, I'm not Shoot your arrows at him. Ram him! Oh, dude, he rammed him. That's a, that's a shit boy. That's a shit boy. Or a captain boy. Shoot him! Do I have? Oh, I got my braziers, dude. Oh, oh, fire boys! They're actually helping me compete. I'm trying to hide. I'm sorry about the CP in my whole ship. Yeah, you're about to sink. Is this about who can sink who fast? You gotta ram them, dude. You got your fire, boys. No, I'm so close. They killed you. Jonas, I lost my ship battle. Yeah, dude. All right, that's fine. We won't do that again. <laughs> yeah, you got to ram them harder. What? Jonas, not in front of the viewers. Don't tell me to ram harder in front of the viewers. Yeah, I don't know. Julia Stiles. There was Julia Stiles who just kind of fell off the plate face of the earth. She was really popular. Mandy Moore. She just like never got Well, she going. was a singer before that, right? I don't know. And then who was the other one? The one that was in uh, Heroes. Save, save the Cheerleader. She was also on like a another show. Oh, Hayden. Hayden Panettiere. Yeah, she kind of felt she after she went on that other TV drama. Yeah, it was like something that she was a country in, singer. Yeah, some shit. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, this said, the truth is that no one knows why she disappeared from acting. She was one of the most promising young actors actresses during her rise, and she felt in her falls a strange mystery. <laughs> Sounds like she she <laughs> pissed you, off the wrong people. Can dude. you cite your sources, Jonas? I that is Teen Gazette Weekly Review. <laughs> Gazette Review. <laughs> Is it Teen Weekly? She does, like, Habitat for Humanity now. Oh. I mean, yeah. I guess, dude. Career. Hold on, I'm looking at Wikipedia, because you know that's legit. <laughs> really? I know. Okay, I'm going to have to start all the way from back here now. All right, no fights on the way over to Marini's, dude. Yeah, dude, I, I looked. I don't, I don't really care enough. <laughs> I don't really either. I was just making conversation because that's what we're supposed to do. Yeah, dude, I was just wondering. I, I mean, I was curious about her life. <laughs> no, you you just said you weren't. Now you, you know, I was, I was consistency, letting, dude. Speaking I, coherent sentences. I don't care about her. <laughs> I was curious why she fell off the face of the earth, but I don't give a shit why. You don't care. Why. That's would, just the truth. Would you care? Out would you care if I? I would this? absolutely care. Who would I do these podcasts with and these game videos? Wow, is that the only worth I have to you, Jonas? Oh man, also you're my homie. I don't know what I do. <laughs> Don't say it with that smile on your face, you son of a bitch. <laughs> you ever? <laughs> you ever call me your homie? <laughs> How dare you call me your homie, you bastard? Are you using fast mode right this now? This is the fastest oh I got, God, man. Dude. I told you it's got to be band heavy, and you want to look up Julia Styles. I told you this, you're my homie, and this, then you had to tell me I was not. This all stems from you asking me who my favorite new kids on the block is without be? having any reference on who the new kids on the block you are. You said Donnie McLaren. What are the members, Jonas? If you uh, can name four of the five members. There's Joey. Wrong. John, nope. Danny, None Jordan, the, and Donnie. Those are the five of them. Those are actually all their names. What about Timmy? 
Timmy. You didn't even put him Timmy in there. Timmy Two-Tone? There wasn't a Timmy. There was two a Timmy. He came later. Timmy was later? Yeah. Let me look <laughs> him up, dude. No, dude, did you? Okay, so, like, when New Kids on the Block, like, fell off, which, you know, that happened pretty quick. With yeah, a lot dude. of the boy bands only last about five, six years or whatever. Um, they actually made a super group with, uh, not in sync, the other one. BSB in, in KTOB. It was BSB and KTOB. What? Are you talking on the phone? You, you're, you're taking a phone call right now? Jonas, what are you, are you telling me, you just put up a one hold up finger, like you're gonna say something valuable, you're not saying anything. But this man literally just took a phone call in the middle of our YouTube video. This is the freaking consummate professional I have to work with. I'm not fighting you, sir. No, I don't care. I'm not fighting you. I got things to do, all right? I got to get a two away from Athens or something. Jonas, could you please stop? Hey, I'm here. I'm, <laughs> I, couch, couch man. <laughs> could you please stop Call saying, me. oh, shit. I, I thought he was, I was making sure he was okay. He left here. And I want to make sure he was all right. Oh, I'm glad he he made it home safely. But Couchman Pete, I, I'll call you back. Because <laughs> he, he is I talk right, about right. anything. Yeah, man. It, hey, I know I'm normally a professional. No, Couchman Pete was... left here, and let me tell some honest shit. He tried to lock our door, and he doesn't live here. When he left, I was making sure he made it home all right. No, are you saying that he was intoxicated? You traveled half no, dude, he was he was white. <laughs> you let that man drive home. You didn't take uh, his keys. Uh, NKOTB. When they came back and did what? No, Jones, we're not talking about BSB and KTOB anymore. Oh, when they toured together. Yeah, but it was like a super group, and they did like mashups of their songs. D did you watch it? Absolutely, I did. Oh, was that your favorite? Who's your Dude. favorite of all of them? Uh, the, of what? BSB. What was your favorite sex scene between the two of them? Of BSB. <laughs> wow, who was my favorite BSB? I couldn't member? name all the BSBs. I think I was a. Uh, I think I like the bad boy. <laughs> Who's that? I don't remember Chad. I don't remember. Chad, his name's Chad. No, it's Chad. Not Chad, dude. It was. There was Donnie and there was. There's two, Donnie's a new kid. There bro. was two Brians. Like. It, was, I don't know any of. I wasn't Justin Timberlake in them. No, there was a Chris. Or was he in sync? He was in sync. I definitely there was a J.C. Chavez or something, J.C. Right? Chavez, yeah, Chavez was one of them. And Joey Fat One, or Fatone, as he goes by. He oh, was, that's right. His last name was Fat One. Joey Fatone, dude, because he, he does like... Uh, Dancing with the Stars or something? Yeah, he does. Dude, I don't understand how these guys get these jobs where they're just like... Hey, I'll be the host of the show. I really don't do anything except explain what's happening. Yeah, dude. And like the dude from Saved by the Bell who does that now. Who? Mario Lopez? Yeah, dude. Mario Lopez is always well, just inter it's, introducing it's something. It's because they're trying to cling to their teen fame. No, it's because they're out here making way more bread than me or you. Dude, like, just I would introducing be the host stuff. of any show if anyone it, wanted me to it, be. Uh, that's my point. So should I like try? Oh, you need to sell some things. Yeah, we'll get there. I'm gonna go get this bird real quick because now I know birds are important. Bird boy. Birds matter, Jonas. Bird lives matter. Yeah, I think it's probably that's Ka -ka. one of them, and then the other one is way over. Oh my there. god, dude! Kaka point. All right, so I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna go get this bird since we're bantering right now. We're talking about Backstreet Boys and NSYNC. I don't know how long we can go on with it, but no, we're dude. Um. I don't know anything about NSYNC or Backstreet Boys. You never really listened to no, them. No, dude, I was old. I was definitely really big in the in the Backstreet Boys. This Why is, is that? Uh, I don't know, dude, because I like hearing men sing, okay? It's All not, right, you like their instrument to be their tonsils. <laughs> <laughs> if a man knows how to use his tonsils, then you know <laughs> how to use <laughs> He can bellow out. He can bellow whatever he needs to bellow, you know? I love it when a man knows what he's doing with them tonsils. <laughs> Jesus, that sounds terrible. But no, honestly, I, I've always had this where I just, I, I prefer to hear men singers than I do women singers. And it's like, I do like respect like the women singers out there. And I've even heard some songs that I like. Like, I love a good Katy Perry or Beyonce oh, song. Oh, this guy coming out with the true heat. But uh, I do prefer to hear men sing. 
just because I can kind of relate more to it. I feel you, man. I, uh, because, like, go back and thinking about, like, rock bands. Like, I, like, rock bands that have female lead vocalists. Yeah. I'm not really a big fan of. Um, solo artists, as far as being women, I mean, that's pretty good. It's just, like, I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't think women can be a solo artist or a rapper or whatever. I, I'm perfectly fine who's with Who's your that. favorite female rapper? Uh, probably Nicki Minaj, only because there it is. There's not a lot of girls in that landscape anyway. So. Right, or the ones that are at least halfway decent. <laughs> wow. <laughs> though, though I will say is that my uh, you like Rhapsody Pink? is really good. I have heard her album and I've listened to it multiple times. What about Winnie. Who? Winnie who? I don't Hooper? Know. Just, just I think I saw a video on YouTube of some girl named Winnie who could rap. <laughs> you just making up the. No, I think that's really true, exist? but I, it, it, I think it was trash if I listened to it. Oh, probably. no. I, don't I was know just who, being facetious. I don't know who that is. Yeah. But Jean Grey, excellent rapper. Um, Cardi B, not so much. Cause she Wait, why is she so hot then right now? Not uh, like hot like in life, because, but hot like in the, on the mainstream. Well, people fell in love with the story of Cardi B. Because she, she went was, stripper, become yeah, musician? She, she was a girl from the Bronx. She used to strip and be sticking up dudes and stuff, you know, just trying to make it out there in these streets. And then, you know, she got a hot song and people fell in love with that, man. And there was a lot of people who, you know, didn't really think she deserved it. And there was some of that. How, but did she get it because she was dating the Migos guy? No, that didn't that didn't happen until after she got the uh, the hit song. Like, so how did her hit song, ha like, who, like, who put that song out? Uh, she had been putting out music for years and years. And I really don't want to make this the Cardi B show. Cause the F well, I'm just asking you if you but, know uh, anything about the story. We can be a quick yeah, synopsis. No, that's cool. Um, She, uh... She had been putting out songs for years. Like, I've heard Cardi B albums before, but I was just Like, never... before whatever that Bodak song was, right? That yeah. Was the one. But I was just, like, never, like, I need to hear this. Why can't I dive? Fun, fun, funny story. <laughs> when that uh, when that album dropped, yeah. I uh, I was out uh, playing volleyball. I played the same volleyball. This has been mentioned before. And uh, some guy that came hooked up some music. And he put on the Cardi B album, Ugh. and uh, it played through or whatever. And I guess he wasn't paying attention. And I think it played through more than once to the point where some people that weren't with our group came over and was and she was like, "Listen, I don't mind if you're playing music, but this is like the third time this Cardi B album came on. Can you please <laughs> change the song to something else?" <laughs> and I was like. <laughs> you on that girl <laughs> <laughs> look um and, and as far as her album is concerned dude it was a good album honestly it wasn't bad i could listen to it i could probably there's songs on there i really enjoyed but you know there's some discrepancy with her writing her own music and oh so she's got a screenwriter a ghost, a writer. ghost writer i don't know if they're a ghost if everybody knows about it Who's writing for her? Migos? No. No, they can't write those words. I don't know. Honestly, but if you look in, you know, the credits for the songs, it say it's co written by you know. Oh, gotcha. So if she was like right here I wanna say the then there you go. Now she got her co writer, but he's really the whole writer. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. So, you know, it is what it is. It kind of delegitimizes a rapper when they do not write their own stuff. Yeah, but as a musical. Issue? Uh, a little bit, yeah, because there was some. It did come to pass that he had, had used a ghostwriter on a few songs. Though he does claim to write most of his stuff, but it, it kind of put an asterisk on your, on your whole career. It if does. you find out that people wrote any of your stuff. Yeah, just because, like. Uh, rappers, uh, we, we they don't play their own instruments, so the only thing they got that makes them legitimize is the fact that they write their own music. And it's, can have a flow, I guess, too. Well, I mean, because yeah, you can be able to write and not have a flow. That's why there's a ghostwriter. Because <clears throat> the ghostwriters can write, they can't rap. Uh, rapping is like the performance, but writing is what really, really matters anyway. That's true. I, I mean... The wordplay, the et cetera, et cetera. <laughs> Sure. Hey, you remember this guy? Yeah, he, dude. He wanted me to help him do some stuff, and I didn't want to. At least I. You're think like, I will not fight Spartans. All right, what did I do? I made it uh, here. Uh, that's it, dude. Okay, game froze. Oh my God. Okay. Stock the and double the patrols. Oh, dude, this is a big moment. If it Baros is. is sending them, I want to know the she's moment. Gonna, she's gonna. She's gonna dog Cassandra. Yes, watch. Archon, please. The merchants have. I understand your concerns. But protecting the town and the quarries is what's most important. 
You may all go. I'm gonna meet my mom, Johnny. Dude, this is a big moment. She's been searching forever. <clears throat> it's gonna happen. Don't let her walk away. What are you scared of? She's a big bad killer now. She's all scared. She knows. Why she's gonna be like Cassandra. I never thought I'd get to see you. The meeting is over. Oh no. Mater? My eyes, I could still see you falling. I thought I had lost you. Alexios is alive. Oh, both of your children are alive. They have him, don't they? You damn right. Who do they have? They got Demos, man. Remember, well, she stole her son. Yeah, but he's a I cultist, dude. From ashes. Yeah, but he just doesn't know do his you mom's understand? alive. Unicorn. No, <laughs> we have to get him back. Nah, dude, we gotta fight, bro. He's too far gone. I gave up on you both once. Never. Mom, again. come on. You knew our bro was alive, and you're now you're all like, let's go find him. No, she didn't know. How what have you? you? What have you been doing? I have a lot. I've been killing questions. people forever, finding. You. <laughs> I think we both do. But ask. I'll answer what I can. Oh, dude, it's mama daughter time. Uh, who's my father? I want to know about my real father. How did you know? I was told. Nikolaos, you saw him. In Megaris, yes. Nikolaos was your father. He was the man who raised you until he took his Spartan duty too far. He mentioned another. What can you tell me about him? I always Mom, hoped you, you would never know to discover the truth. But there are things you need to know if we are to stop the cult. What Let do me you mean? You on your entire life. He sought me out before I knew your fa- Nikolaos. I've not heard from him in a long time. What's wrong? Soldiers from Paros just made landfall in the cove. A small force, maybe a dozen. Malaka. Oh, snap. Timo, gather the troops. Damn it, I only got one question. Questions will have to wait, Lam. I want to help. I assume you can use those weapons. Better uh, than when yeah. you No, I just so. carry them around with me. Good. Come. All right, Who is attacking go. Paros across the bay? Where are you going, lady? Sinanos has finally grown tired of sharing the mother with Why now? We've always had problems with Paros. I expected oh an attack, just not so soon. Wait, wait, I guess wait. the time for talking is over. <laughs> Where, you just gonna, you're just gonna take off? Where's my horse? <laughs> Princess Sparkle Steps. Off we go now. Yeah, yeah, wait for me. Yeah, my, I like your horse and all, but can it do this? Can it make rainbow steps when it walks? No. What's your horse's name? Oh, she's got the, she's got the little pink purple leader thing. Oh, Ooh, hey, let's stop here. Dude, on the next episode. On the next episode. Oh. <laughs> that is all time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe while you're at it. Why don't you one of your friends send them our way? Do it. Yes. But for Jonas. And for TNT Nine, we are out.